Hey guys, it's Maddie, and today we are bringing you a new episode from our series called Trucker Talk, where we will be telling you the backstory behind some of the industry's most iconic driver lingo. On today's episode number three, we will be going over warnings and well wishes used commonly while conversing out on the road on the CB radio. Let's jump right in. Breaker Breaker 1-9, these are your good buddies over here at Jack's Chrome, just here to say stay loaded and stack them eights. Because on today's episode of Trucker Talk, we will be walking y'all through some of the most commonly used warnings and well wishes when it comes to CB culture that will have you ready to roll out on the road, looking like a regular in the radio realm. Starting us off today... We thought we would cover what it means to stay loaded and stack them eights like we made mention of in our intro. Although staying loaded is fairly simple in the sense it gets straight to the point, which is to keep on trucking or stay loaded down and continue to carry on moving freight and making money. Stack them eights, on the other hand, isn't quite as intuitive, as this trucking term and its fellow well-wishing phrase threes and eights have a few different interpretations. While the majority of truckers would tell you that these terms come from the 10 codes, essentially meaning stay busy in service, stacking up that money, some would say the slang threes and eights actually dates back to the earlier days of truck driving when truckers drove eight hours on and three hours off, which also indicates the intention of remaining behind the wheel of a big rig and making more money. Speaking of numbers like threes and eights, the catchphrase good numbers also is a commonly used courtesy, showing your support for fellow drivers while out on the road. These so-called good numbers not only include threes and eights, but also sixes, which speaking of being busy wheeling and dealing is short for busy in CB slang and also comes from the 10 codes. Switching gears with some well wishes that tend to be a bit more intuitively interpreted, the famous catchphrase, keep the shiny side up and the dirty or greasy side down, as well as keep the rubber side down and the bugs off the glass, both mean to stay safe and remain upright, rolling down the road in your rig, not in a wreck. As we dive deeper into trucker talk, with some of the most well-known warnings called out on the CB, we will also explore the exact reason why the CB radio was so well received by not only the trucking community, but also by so-called bears or police officers. Cops have been called bears by truckers basically since the beginning of time, probably because of their big, bad, bear-like demeanor towards truck drivers, but also because of their Smokey the Bear style hat, often worn by law enforcement personnel. When it comes to other warnings often used on the air, most of them make some sort of reference to the boys, or shall I say, bears in blue. In fact, since bears often appear in all different shapes, sizes, etc., many truckers will even specify the exact type of bear, with terms like county mountie, short for sheriff, city kitty or local yokel, code for local cops, Papa or full-grown bear, short for a state trooper. Mama or sugar bear, for a female officer. Baby bear being a rookie police. Evil Knievel, alluding to a motorcycle cop. And diesel cop, denoting the DOT. Unmarked, undercover cop cars are called something else completely, however, and can be identified generally as a fox in the hen house, and specifically as polar bears when in a white cruiser. The CB has helped tons of truckers beware of bear traps, or so-called speed traps, set up to snatch speed racer rigs and allow drivers to advise their fellow freight hauling friends to slow down and drive the double nickel, aka an extremely cautious 55 miles per hour exactly, in order to avoid a bear bite or a so-called speeding ticket. 
Speaking of supposed speed or bear traps, sometimes, in order to avoid any encounters with law enforcement, semi-truck drivers would send someone to shake the bushes or run their rig ahead of the rest in order to provoke any police officers and distract them from dinging the other drivers. Speeding cars that also shake the bushes are known as bear bait, which was perhaps made most famous in the fan-favorite Freight Holland film, Smokey and the Bandit. Shaking the bushes also often came alongside another common CB catchphrase known as brush your teeth and comb your hair, which is basically a warning to straighten up because cops are coming up ahead. Some other warnings to watch out for on the wide open road would be alligators, aka big pieces of tire on the side of the road that will tear up your truck much like an alligator might, as well as other actual animals like polecats, also known as smelly skunks. Antler alley is another animal-related trucking term that intuitively can be interpreted as an area where deer are known for crossing. Also be careful and extra cautious for construction cones and barrels, or so-called Snyder eggs or baby Snyders, nicknamed because of their bright orange color that can't be missed, much like the looks of a pumpkin orange Snyder truck. There are some warnings and well wishes for you folks to get you by behind the wheel of a big bad rig. For more trucker talk, tune into our next episode where we will be diving a bit deeper into the culture of the CB and further developing your dictionary of trucking terms by covering cities, states, and other driver destinations. But for now, all of us here at Jack's Chrome are wishing you well. So stay loaded and stack them eights. Oh, and fair warning, don't forget to watch out for those big bad bears. JCS over and out, y'all. Thanks for tuning into this episode of Trucker Talk. Before you leave, make sure you like the video, check out the other videos on our channel, and subscribe. We have finally reached our goal of 30k subscribers, so thank you all so much for your support for the show. Next stop, 50k. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, or anything else you'd like to talk to us about, please be sure to tune in to our live podcast, The Chrome Corner, Wednesdays at 12 p.m. noon Eastern Standard Time, and discuss all things Chrome with our host, Dave Coleman. If you'd like to stay up to date with the new projects we have coming, please follow us at Jack's Chrome Show on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Be sure to buy your big rig the best chrome for your home with some sweet stainless sales, including $100 off blind mount bumpers, $50 off billet pedals, and a special steering wheel deal. When you purchase a Steering Creations wheel, you get half off your hub kit on our website at jackschromeshop.com. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week. And remember, folks, if your rig don't shine, you don't know Jack. Jack.